wanted to briefly talk about the subconscious mind, that unseen part of your soul that records everything even while you're asleep. It's apart from your conscious mind, but your conscious mind doesn't exactly record in the way the subconscious does. So, and this was this is what's so dangerous about watching television and movies that do not uplift, that do not edify black women. We take in these things. We've been, you know, you're mentally sort of beat up with. And, and you know what? Let me let me back up. Let me back up. It doesn't take anyone to say that. You, you're undesirable. All you have to do is put forth images. Images will get locked into your mind from a young age. And it's just like how when many of us were coming up and we watched the shampoo commercials and the, you know the woman takes her hair down and okay it's nice and done and she you know it's usually a white woman and she's swinging her hair around and in so many ways they're saying this is the standard of beauty. People do not have to tell you that. Only certain segments as you look across YouTube would, would have to do that. They have to shout it because they have an agenda. And unfortunately a lot of the, the black men in the community have been affected or should I say infected by that too. Um, I, I'm not going to address those men too much. This channel is not for the men. I may mention them as I run by some things just to demonstrate some things. But I'm going to uplift you. I'm going to spend my time uplifting you. So we have to, you have to fix that. So this is why we have to speak words. Words are powerful. Speak kind words to each other. Speak words that bless each other. It will get into your mind. It will get into your soul, your subconscious. And sometimes we may become unsuccessful in life because of certain beliefs that we have held deep down. And we have to find on our own journey where those beliefs come from. We have to go back and, and pull it out. If you're not successful in the financial area, there's, there's a reason why you have to find that. You really have to find that. Uh, if you're unsuccessful in the dating arena, okay, well, let's go back and find out, is there something going on in your mind? Always start with self first, because sometimes there could be outside influences. Maybe you're in a wrong environment. You, um, you, you know, you have a, a uniqueness about you that, you, you know, you already have a standard and everything around you is not that standard so you have to place yourself in that atmosphere also and I'm going to talk about this in another video if there is a situation that has negative energy you have a, have a bad atmosphere you can change that atmosphere there's a power that everyone has and this has not been taught on a conscious level to black women. We may exhibit it sometimes coming out from a, a, a spot of a place within our hearts from resilience of coming through things. But we have to sort of, uh, how do I want to put this? Um, we, we have to recognize the power that we all have. And that, that's what I want to do. What powers do we have? And I'm, not, and, I, and I'm not talking figuratively. We literally have powers. <laughs> we really do. And we don't realize it. If there's something going on in your atmosphere, in your sphere of things that you don't like, you can change it. And I will tell you how. I will tell you how. Just, just subscribe. And you will run across that video when it's up. 
So that's why all I want to tell you ladies, work on that subconscious. You can pull that out. Just sit back and relax. And ask yourself, what do I need to work on? And to rid ourselves of that negative energy. To rid ourselves of those weights that have been weighing us down. And you will find that, it's, and it's not overnight, and you will find that over time, you will become much lighter. And you will be quicker at making decisions. You will become more confident in, in your walk in this life. And that's it, ladies. Stay tuned for the next video.